Two Trump's lawyer could be witnesses or targets in FBI investigation. Two lawyer for Donald Trump could become witnesses or targets in the obstruction investigation connected to the criminal probes of the former president's unauthorized retentions of highly sensitive government document at his Mar-a-Lago resort in Florida, according to legal experts. The lawyers Christina Bob and Evan Kokorin face becoming esnarch in the investigation because they liaise the Justice Department's during the government's month-long effort to retrieve boxes of presidential records and classified documents from Trump's Florida home. At issue is an interaction that took place on 3rd of June in which, according to a court filing submitted by the Justice Department, in a separate but related case on Tuesday, the two lawyers made representation that they had complied with the grand jury, Sapona, that subsequently proved to be false. That day, the Justice Department's chief of counterintelligence, Jay Brad, and three FBI agents traveled to Mar-a-Lago to collect the documents that have been subpoenaed, the filling said, and Bob and Kokorin turned over a tape, read well envelope of classified material. But before Brad departs, Bob produced a signed a letter certifying that all and any documents responsive to the subpoena were being turned over, while Kokorin indicate that the records the government had sought were confined to one storage room, the filling said. The trouble of the two Trump's lawyer is that the Justice Department then developed evidence through municipal sources that additional presidential and classified documents remain at Mar-a-Lago, which proved to be the case when the FBI searches the property two months later. In its own feeling Wednesday night, Trump's lawyer decreed the search as having taken place in the midst of the standard give and take between a former president and the National Chief and Record Administration over presidential records. It said the department has graciously made public certain information, including a photograph of classified documents taken from home. According to the search warrant and court filing, the Justice Department is investigating, among other crimes, whether there was potential obstructions of justice with respect to how Trump's and his lawyer have seemingly been resistant to return documents belonging to the government. The Justice Department account of the 3rd of June episode what it has described as likely effort to conceal presidential and classified documents sought by the government, raised the prospect that both Bob and Corcoran could become witnesses in the construction investigation. But the case and how the Justice Department might approach the issues remain complex. The question for federal prosecutors become whether the two Trump's lawyer will fully missile the Justice Department so that Trump could keep the documents or whether the lawyer made the representations because they themselves were missed by chumps. To establish the exact circumstances around Bob's confident in signing the certification and Kokorin confident in his statement, legal experts said the Justice Department would probably have to move to Sapona, both of the lawyer of communication and testimony. Such a step would immediately run into an issue about attorney-client privilege, since the kind of information the Justice Department would be trying to extract for a potential obstruction case target Trump would be protected communication between Trump and his lawyer. People close to the former president top lawyer broadly did not appear to believe either Bob or Kokorin would be compelled to testify against Trump and remove themselves from the legal team. And as the Wednesday, neither had retained their own counsel, one of the people said. That's all for today. Thank you and goodbye.